It's Christmas, and I'm ready to make a change. What's up, cutie pie? How you doing? But first, this is my arsenal. The Sony 10 to 20 f4.0 APS-C lens, the Sony 20 millimeters f1.8 G lens, full frame, and the Sony 24 to 105 G lens, f4.0, which is also a full frame. So you could say that I got a 16 millimeters to 420 millimeters range. Back to the video, what is my main usage? It's really cold, man. I travel a lot, like a lot, guys. So I want to get as wide as possible recordings, to be as light as possible with the best light as possible and the best possible quality. Now, the 1020 versus 14 is a no-brainer. The 14 versus the 20 is also a no-brainer. See, they both have what I need, the aperture ring and the f1.0. The 24 to 105 is just a beautiful lens that I still learn about every time that I use it. So with the former two lenses, it finally got to me. I want the widest range I can get with the best light. And the 40 millimeters gives me both what the 1020 and the 20 millimeter can give me. And some of you might be like, okay, you know, you forget the six millimeters, you know, the 40 and the 20. Um, not really. Now this is gonna be recorded on the iPhone 14 Pro. However, I do want you to understand what I'm doing right here. Like this would represent four times zoom. Let me get something, okay, something like this. And going to three times zoom would give me a lot more width. Like, check that out. This is three times zoom. Going to two times zoom, this is the difference. And here's your one time lens, which looks like this. So you do understand that there's a very big difference right here that's going on between this one and this one. And no, 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 we're not pixel peeping here. No need for that. My videos are for my own documentation. No need for the fame and the gain, you know. We on our way to the store. I'm either gonna ruin this video or it's gonna be nice. But uh, let's continue with the video. I got it, and I love it. And now follows a series of videos, especially recorded in the evening, so you can see the quality of this lens. Down on a one tail with fifty on the frame shutter. That's what's up. 